My favorite part is probably the reactions. A lot of the nursing home patients, they don't get visitors often or only on the weekends, so having an unsuspected visitor that's bringing flowers is just awesome to see their reaction. They're usually in shock and think we have the wrong room. My name is Brittany Sard and I'm with Petals for Hope. So we essentially um, come into events and weddings and pick up all of the flowers that are left over and then we repurpose them, recut them and deliver them to nursing homes, hospice care, hospitals and just various organizations where the residents could use some joy. I used to work in the event industry so I know the amount of waste that occurs and so it kind of just clicked to repurpose the flowers and it was going to be a hobby, just something that I was going to do in my free time and it sort of turned into like a full-time thing. We're servicing typically three to five weddings in a weekend um, and then we're delivering flowers. Usually all seven days out of the week we're doing deliveries. We don't charge for the service but we accept donations so that's pretty much how we operate. We do a lot of events, fundraising, silent auctions, that sort of thing. Today we were doing a flower arranging workshop. So it's more set up like a flower bar. We come in and kind of give basic instructions on how to break down arrangements and then kind of arrange them in a vase so that they're able to be given to the hospice patients. A lot of hospice centers will get huge arrangements from weddings, funeral homes, and they can't take them into the patient's room. So we were just giving an overview of how exactly to break them down. If you'd like to get in contact with me, you can go to petalsforhope.com or email hello at petalsforhope.com.